Hello and welcome back to the village. Another blindingly roasting day. 35 today. Okay, so in this video we're going to be talking about a broken mains water pipe. Yeah, just over a week ago we had a massive electrical storm one night. The lightning was absolutely phenomenal to say the least but uh, the bangs, the thunder, were very, very strong indeed. And I think it's that which broke our water pipe, our mains water pipe. Um, we had a guest staying with us and their car alarm went off. So that shows you how strong that was. It was right here. And we didn't want to dig up the patio. So it was on the wrong side of the clock. In other words, the right side of the water clock for us. It's on the municipality's side. So we called them um, and we had to wait for them to come. So this is the story of our burst water pipe. I don't know if you can see in there, but there's a hole under our patio. And a good few days ago now, we had a massive storm one evening and it was so loud, the thunderclap, that a car on the driveway the uh, alarm, the motion alarm went off, so it was that that loud. So we had this leak, and we've made this sort of channel, which goes down this part of the garden, and it's a runaway there. So after a, as I say, a few days, we're now waiting for the water people to come. Hello Phoebe. Phoebe. Say hello. We thought it could have been like the massive water downpour was just draining off the hill but it hasn't and this is forget the uh, I'll try and get the shadow out of the way. So down there is uh, the stopcock and everything. So we'll see what happens. Doesn't make the garden look very good though, with a channel, but it's what has to be done. So after a few days, uh, we had to get, or Tam's father had to get in touch with the uh, water authorities and they came down and the hole under the patio that we've got, um, well, we're not going to dig up the patio, it's going to cost too much and real nightmare. So uh, they've come along and they've gone from our neighbours, found where the water pipe comes on this property, dug down and joined uh a new pipe and you must probably can hear in the background that at the moment as i'm doing this the uh, the small digger is in now and apparently they're not going to take up the patio or any part of it they're going to fire a compressed rocket <laughs> that's what they call it but i think they're going to force with compressed air a hole underneath the patio and then hook it up to the mains but um, let's see, let's see how that goes. So this is where they've dug up on this rather large hole. Um, and from down there on our, in our neighbors, the pipe comes down. Anyway, they found it here, dug down, and they've joined a new pipe to it. And coming round the back, this of course looks a catastrophe now. But yeah, a little bit of manual work and the grass will grow again. Um, 
hope I don't slip. Last time I was messing about on hills here, I broke my ankle for those of you that followed the vlog. Whoops, let's see. So there they are. There goes the, uh, the digger, so the channel is there and I hope you can see it and there's the pipe Thank you. 
Amazingly, all done, as you could see, in just a few hours. I think they were here for four hours tops. Of course, the grass is ruined, they've dug up everything. But hey, we can put that back to rights within the next few weeks or so, especially when the heat gets a little bit less. And next year, you'll never have known that we had this problem. The great thing about it for us was we didn't have to wait days and days because that would have been flushing the toilet with buckets and not being able to shower and all those other things that people like you and I have got used to having. Well, thanks very much indeed for watching the videos. Please do come back to the channel whenever you can and do watch the videos right to the end. It does help the uh, algorithm. Any comments you've got, drop them down below and we'll see you on the next video. And stay safe wherever you are in the world.